Good morning, y'all. Ooh, hold on. I'm about to make us a quick little breakfast and um, I need to start editing because I need to get a video out tonight. My table gets here today, so that's exciting. They're supposed to come between 11 and one and I hope they do because Zara has an appointment at two all the way in Falls Church, so I need to leave by like probably 1.15 in order to get there 15 minutes before my appointment, so. Yeah, I'm excited to see the table. I'm excited to show you guys. It shouldn't be hard for them to put together. I don't even know if they have to put it together. I think they can just bring it in and plop it down. And then I can assess it, see and make sure it fits the space right. And then I can start decorating it, putting my Christmas decor on it. I'm so excited, so excited. But yeah, I'm about to make us our little Trader Joe's pancakes. You already know, we are obsessed with those. Um, probably some turkey bacon. Oh dang, she don't got no fruit. Mm, I'll give her yogurt. And I'm gonna make me a coffee, I think. Do I want coffee? I don't know, we'll see. I wanna get some juice. Oh, I have my protein shake. Go do that. I wanna buy one of her dad's gifts today while we're out there, cause it's in Falls Church. So I wanna try to do that today. Obviously I can't show you guys because my husband watches these vlogs, so. <laughs> but yeah, my table gets here, I'm so excited. So that'll be, probably be the next time that y'all see me, cause I'm just gonna be editing right now. This is why I want a juicer, so I can make my own juice shots. So today, ginger. This one burns a little bit. But it does taste good though. Ooh. <coughs> oh my gosh. I still got more. Ooh. Wow. They like these ingredients in this one. Oh. All right, Pottery Barn just called me. <laughs> and I'm like, it's always something with deliveries, furniture deliveries. Merry Christmas, y'all. It's not Christmas yet, baby, but almost. Look at my Mr. Grinch clothes. Yeah, you look so I cute. like Mr. Grinch. <laughs> but yeah, it's always like something with furniture deliveries. However, Pottery Barn is always nice enough to give me a call, Ashley, and call me at all. But anyway, <clears throat> I guess the um, truck is like a stop before our house. It's always a stop before our house. And I guess it's been breaking down. It officially like broke down. So they don't have an ETA anymore. I'm hoping it still gets delivered. Because I'm like, y'all stop away. Where y'all at? I'll come pick it up myself. <laughs> but they said they'll call me and let me know. So I don't think that they're going to deliver it before me and Zara leave for the appointment. So hopefully my husband can come here and meet them. But yeah, wanted to update y'all on that. <laughs> I'm still hopeful it'll get delivered today. If not, we gonna come pick it up. One of Zara's um, presents just delivered and she's home obviously. And the package shows what the hell it is. So I had to tell her just to go to her room, just close the door and I'll tell you when to come down. <laughs> so I need to go grab this real quick. And like, I think, where am I hiding at? I'll probably hide it in the playroom's closet for now. Cause she doesn't go in that closet. Okay, let's go, y'all. Mm -mm. My husband gotta get this one, y'all. This too heavy. Hey. So luckily the back of the box doesn't say what it is. So I just left it in the garage. My husband can bring it up or put it away later when he get home. Cause ain't no way in hell. That thing's too heavy. Oh my God. Okay, Zara, I'm done. All right, back to editing y'all. Back to editing. Oh my gosh. I wanted to show you guys the table. It came in yesterday. I didn't get to film it cause I had to take Zara to her appointment, but my husband was here. Look. Don't mind what's on the table. That's not staying. But look how thick this thing is. This is the Palisades table from Coffee. From what the hell? <laughs> from Pottery Barn. Sorry, my uh, little bugs in the back getting it right now. But yes, she fills the space perfectly. And then, um, of course, when the Christmas tree's not here, 
I plan on putting like an accent chair over there so it'll really like bring the space together but I am so excited to start shopping for decor for this I want like larger pieces just because the space in there is so big not to like completely fill it but to just make it like more y'all will see <laughs> I have a whole thing in mind but yeah I think it looks really good with the space and matches the house very well it's just really really pretty I love it I love it I love it I was contemplating changing this rug and putting this one in our room and then changing this one to like more of a cream because I thought it was going to be more of a lighter like ivory color and it turned out to be more gray and initially I was saying this matches our backsplash but I'm going to be changing out our backsplash to match this table so it's just one solid piece anyway so we'll see I think I might want this rug to be the ivory color that I initially wanted and then put this rug upstairs in our room because this matches our room better our uh couch that's in the playroom someone's about to come pick it up thank god it sold I've been talking to him since Wednesday I think so yeah he's finally coming today so that'll be up and out the way and then y'all I'm bringing back this Ikea rug I've decided it's too small it's like it's too skinny if it had a little bit more width to it it would be good and then yeah I just I don't I don't think it fits the space well even with the couch being gone so this couch is gonna be leaving us and then um, yeah I'm gonna return the Ikea rug and just get something else somewhere else because I'm not I'm not liking it um, I have to get the extra pillows for this couch. Oop, the couch is ready to be picked up. So I was thinking with this table, I think I might bring her little table back because I just remembered for the patio, I'll be doing a different furniture like layout up there. So I won't need the patio table and the patio table is already in the process of being painted black. I had already started that. And I was like, okay, it's probably easier to paint that one black rather than having to sand this one up, prime it, and paint it. I can just use the one that's upstairs. It's the same size, perfect height. It looks a little bit more like restaurant-y too. So I was like, hmm, I could just return this and then use that one that's upstairs down here since it's already in the process of being painted black that way i'm not doing stuff twice i, I don't like doing stuff twice <laughs> so i might return this table definitely returning the rug and then yeah the space is it's coming together it's coming together and i'm just like i'm just super excited so and then you guys i've changed the plan for this so this is not going to look like this anymore i saw this thing on pinterest i'll insert a photo here for a way for us to utilize this space a lot more so i'm going to be doing like built-ins into the wall and then maybe like a wallpaper or something behind there maybe like a wood accent and then some built-in wall shelves and then put the tv in the center instead since the couch won't be here anymore that's the whole reason why we put the tv right here and i think that's what we're gonna do that's obviously not gonna happen before christmas so i'm just gonna leave that space open for that to happen but still get all of zara's other things together and whatnot so yeah the plans keep changing because i keep coming down here and looking at everything every time i stare at something i want to change it so that's what's happening down here let me go see where my husband is at. So yeah, my husband is waiting for the guy to come right now. Uh, we sold it just for 400. I put it for five, he offered four. I'm like, whatever, I really don't care. <laughs> I just want it gone. Uh, I had quite a bit of interest on it though. So that was good, but I'm excited to get everything. Everything's coming together. The house is getting more full. I can't wait for like the chairs to come in and everything like that. Oh, he just got here. Nice, he just got here, fantastic the couch is gone yay you see how much more room she has to play now so now i'm gonna get now i know what size rug i need probably like a because that's five by seven an eight by ten would be cool i think that might be too big i don't know we'll see maybe like a seven by seven by nine maybe who knows yeah that's gone it's empty now she has way more room to play here's all the stuff that was under the couch but yeah the family was super nice um just a college student in the military trying to furnish his apartment so that was good yeah now i can start looking for beanbag chairs and a rug and 
I'll probably honestly go to the store today to do that. More things have arrived. Yeah. Loads and loads of boxes coming in over these next couple weeks. I don't know what's in here, y'all. Let's find out. <laughs> I love vlog, but sound stuck in my head. <laughs> Perfect. Her um like faux breads. I have to whisper because she's like right upstairs getting ready. But um her faux breads, they're like realistic. Let me show you. Oh goodness. When in doubt, stab it out. Oh my god, they smell good. Oh, I don't even want to open this all the way because I don't want the scent to like. Oh wow, they smell like actual pastries. Oh my gosh. So this is for her little bakery. Oh, I'm so excited. Sorry, y'all. This I just when I come to baby girl, I'd be so excited. Look at how real, can y'all see? Look at how realistic that looks. Ignore my nails. <laughs> oh my gosh, and it, then it's just like, it's squishy, so. They smell so good, they smell like, like actual muffins. They make me wanna eat it, which well, she won't. She, she'll know that it's not real. Zara's very smart, she knows not to do, like she's not a normal toddler. And then here's her um, felt pizza. I got all this stuff off Amazon, by the way, and it's gonna be in um, like Zara's Playroom toy section. So just look there if you wanna purchase any of this for your kids for the holidays. I have it all in my Amazon store. And then I got this um, felt pizza. Y'all know I don't really like buying plastic toys, so I do felt and wood. They just last longer, trust me. Invest more money into the things that last longer so you don't have to keep buying. But yeah, this is a pizza. It comes with a little pizza tray and this has a pizza box. So it's actually in its pizza box right now, which I thought was just too cute. Oh, that's so it. I don't even know what I bought. Oh, okay, yeah. I got her wood sushi for her little um, restaurant. Oh my gosh. If I had this when I was little, I would never leave my room. That's why I'm just so excited for her because she's about to be like, like I'm gonna cry. I already know because we've surprised her with the playroom before in our other house, but the way we're doing this one is beyond, <laughs> beyond. Okay, what's next? What is next? She has other things coming here today, and I know that they show what it is. So we're about to run to the store real quick. So I'm hoping that they don't get here while we're here or while we're gone because she likes to look for packages at the door and she's always like mommy that's a package and i'm like damn girl what else oh, okay cool so this is like a wood toaster toy i think it's just too cute let me show you guys it's worth it to invest into your children I'm trying to tell you that way Six months down the road, you don't have to keep buying more things because these things are still are durable. They're wood. Look at this. This is a wood toaster. Are you freaking kidding? What? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, uh, and then here's the like the bread and stuff is in here. The butter, the knife, all of that good stuff is inside. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Then, okay, so I got her these faux juices for her restaurant and for her supermarket. They're actual liquid. Can you see it moving? It's so exciting. Okay, cool. Next. Last box. I know Amazon's sick of me. I was thinking about leaving like a, um, like out some snacks and like waters or juices out there by my door. You know how people be doing. Um, because the, the amount of deliveries I have coming the next few days, um, I want to leave them like a treat because my brother used to work for Amazon. He said it's very, very hard 
um, trying to eat while you're working because you're working nonstop. Like he had to pee in a bottle and stuff. So I was like, wow, and they really just don't get a break. At least my brother didn't. So um, I would love to be able to like leave food or something out there, like something that's already prepackaged. So they're not like iffy about it. And then like a thank you sign and like happy holidays. It's just something like that. So I'll probably set that up. Um, I have more packages coming. They've already delivered this one. So let's see. And especially my UPS, my um, USPS driver, he's so sweet. Today I have stuff coming tomorrow and the next day. And it'll stay cold because it's cold outside. So last box. Oh, so I did get her a basket. Well, now she got two. <laughs> so there's a little grocery store basket and it comes with like the wood and the like faux box like groceries and things like that little canned foods and stuff so i did get her a basket okay so maybe i can just return the other basket then because she already has this one but i feel like the wood one is cute too what if we both want a grocery shop we'll need our own bags and then i got her oh yeah this felt sandwich maker you guys see like the bread the ham cheeses and stuff like that it's so cute Again, everything is linked in my Amazon store and I'll link it in my bio I hope, or my description. I hope y'all be looking at my description because I be linking stuff there. I tell y'all where everything is and when I remember. <laughs> but if y'all ask, I still tell you anyway, so. Very cool. Successful haul number one. All right, y'all, we are at At Home. About to look for some beanbag chairs and a new area rug for Zara's playroom. We just returned the desk at Home Goods, so. Hopefully I can find a good rug, a bigger rug than the Ikea one. Ooh, I'm just out here looking like a serial killer, y'all. Anyway, <laughs> I found the beanbag chairs. So I'm thinking about doing either pink or white. I feel like white would get so dirty and I don't want to do black. So I think pink might be the best bet. So they have these ones up here. I was hoping they have some pink ones like this though. They only have white. So let me check the other side. Look at this, y'all. Look at how she gets out of the cart. She has figured this out for herself. Gray. Look at how she gets out. Escape route. Emergency exit. She figured this out on her own. Nice. Those? One all night? Ain't no way. I don't know. These ain't that good for one all night. I'm saying it should be better quality. I can just go to Pottery Barn if that's the case. Yeah, Pottery Barn got really good ones. We might as well buy Pottery Barn. Ooh. Well, let's go look at the area rugs then. The, the price ain't matching the material. I want that one. Look, y'all, it's quality over quantity, okay? Quality over quantity. We're not trying to repurchase. I know, baby. I'm gonna find you ones that are way better than this, cause this is ridiculous. At home was a bust. Uh, they really don't have anything. It's just all strictly holiday decor, really. What are you guys doing? Stop. Couldn't find nothing good there, and it was not worth it. Like the quality of it, not worth it. So we're gonna go to Target now. I thought you meant I opened it on a video. I was like, what did I put on there? Like my social security number or something? Oh, no. But um, no, we are at... Oh, these are so cute. We're at Target now, trying to look for beanbag chairs. My freaking husband being nosy I saw my browsing nosy. history and saw what gift I'm getting him. No, she had a search history open right in front of me it, it, for, a, for a second or two. And you looked. I was That's your in, problem. I was looking in that direction. No, he and looked. Like, boom, and I couldn't like no, hold it in. He like, did it on purpose, y'all. So now he knows what one part of the gift is, which is so annoying. But anyway, we're here looking at the beanbag chairs. So I see they have these. Bobby, I saw these are cute. Scratch. And how much is this? Sixty-five. Are you kidding me? They're sixty-five dollars. Look at that. The other ones were 109 what? not even that. What? Let me see online how much it might be. Let me they pull me up the price tag. Y'all better be um price matching. I done said this in my last vlog now. Start price matching on Target.com. Go to Target. You're annoying, babe. Baby, you opened it in front of me. You're so annoying. You click on the barcode and you can scan it. 
it's way easier than searching it. You just scan it and it'll bring it up. So it's also 65 online, so that's good. All right, price mess privacy, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, so my husband has said that he doesn't like these. What's your reasoning? Well, I didn't say I didn't like them. I feel like you can get more robust, thicker. It's because we found like, some ones that are corduroy over here, but they're gray, but they have some online that we could get. So right. that's what he's thinking about doing. Right. But at least we saw it in person so that we know it's good. Let's look yeah, at it one more one. time. Let's get these ones. Let's look at this one more time. Let me see. Sorry. He likes these because it's more of a chair and then it also has like pockets in it. Yeah, it Vice. Pockets. So. It's a little bit more sturdy. A little more sturdy. Sit in this, Sarah. Sit here. Put there. that down. Put it down. That's sit. it. Okay, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. And she can lean back on that. Lean back. Sit back. Okay, and then has pockets and stuff. Okay, so that makes sense. So they do have these online and they have it in a different color. So we'll probably end up doing that, y'all. You'll see what I mean by indecisiveness. You can't shop with me. You'll be irritated. You ain't gonna wanna get nothing at the end of the day. Okay. So I was deciding since I have so many deliveries coming to my house every single day now until Christmas that I could leave like a cute, you know how people be doing like the snacks and the drinks and stuff for the delivery drivers. I figured I could do that too. And just put them in these cute like little Christmas bags, like just like some chips, some crackers, maybe like a candy bar and like a water bottle. I think I told you guys this earlier. So maybe those are five dollars. What's the difference? Oh, because it comes with how many? How many does it come with? Four count? I think a four count's good, right? I don't have that many delivery drivers. This is four bags for five dollars. Hey, she's trying to figure something out. This is the camera. I'm telling you, it's something about a camera. The people would just be like, but yeah. So I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna get these bags, and then we're gonna go get some snacks. We already have water that we can give them. And then, yeah, I'm going to just leave them outside. I'm going to put a sign next to it that says thank you for all you guys do and happy holidays. So right now for the delivery drivers, we have the Gatorades. That's one cake. We have the gift bags. I got them some full-size candy. And that's the one for the hotel. I got full-size gummies. And then, um, I got them some Reese's Puffs. Why are you making my hotel? Oh, what they call? My Reese's. And then, um. I'm gonna give them some chips no, too. To I've already had two that. delivery drivers yeah. come by today, so Mommy, now I'm gonna be missed out. However, the rest will be able to, well, and I'll put it out stuff. tomorrow as well. Come today. I just made it to our favorite sushi place, <laughs> Matsutake. I don't know if y'all can even see it. It's Matsutake here in Reston. So our lady, Miss Joyce, she is so sweet. She wasn't here last time my husband came, but hopefully she's here today because she's always asking, where is he? He's always working. Usually me and Zara come here. So hopefully she's here today. She is just the sweetest and always be hooking us up. <laughs> Miss Joyce is not here today. I don't think she works weekends, but everybody is still nice regardless. So this is the restaurant. How are you eating? I will eat salmon rolls. Salmon rolls? Yep, I will eat 11. 11? Yeah. Oh, What's the name? said if y'all don't eat raw sushi, it's time to go. <laughs> Oh, we got our sushi, we got a, um, hell, I don't remember. I know we got spicy salmon rolls. These are Zara's. She loves her regular salmon rolls. And then we got a, um, a UFO roll and a dragon eel roll. So there's like eel, salmon, it's all fish. Really, it's all fish. It's all great. All right, get your chopsticks and you can start grabbing your sushi. Make sure you don't touch the spicy one, okay? Don't touch the spicy one. Ego. Uh, yep, go ahead, Ego. Go ahead. Ego. Oh, just <laughs> back home. Um, I don't think I'm getting any more deliveries today. We just had another delivery driver come. I'm like, wait, I have a gift for you. <laughs> or treats, goodies, whatever. But um, I think I'm getting, I think Amazon comes tomorrow. But just in case, I'm going to start making these little gift bags just to have them ready. I don't think I have any more deliveries tonight. Um, so I'm just gonna prep them for tomorrow, but tonight we're going to like a fun little holiday thing in the city. I've been getting nervous about going to big events, but um, I feel like we should be okay. They're gonna have fireworks, hot cocoa, beer garden, kids activities. It's a boat parade show, so that's what we'll be doing. I need scissors. 
So here's the little gift bags once again. And I think I'm just gonna put two bags of chips in each. I think I'm actually gonna do this all month because I'm gonna be ordering things basically up until Christmas. So I think I'm just gonna keep these out there. Not keep them outside, but like daily. I'll just be putting out treats, you know, just even if they just happen, even if they're not delivering to me, they could be delivering to my neighbor. Like if you see it, take it. So I think that's what I wanna do. It's the season of giving, they work hard. They don't get as many breaks. I'm sure they want like a snack or something. So I'm just gonna make these and we're just gonna keep it going until the end of the month, I guess. I've made all the bags. They each have water, Gatorade, two chips, a candy, and a chocolate candy. So now I'm gonna make the sign. Oh, I'm so dumb. I'm over here trying to write this sign, but I'm like, I'm the type of person that my mind is always going. So <laughs> the first one, I put deliverer drivers, right? So I was like, whatever, let me redo it. The second one, I put delivery. <laughs> Delivery driver. <laughs> oh, third time is a charm, y'all. Third time. <laughs> it's a charm. All right, guys, I made my sign. Third time's a charm. I just taped it to a folder that I have and kind of just like makeshift it to be a stand. So, delivery drivers, thank you for all you do. Please take a bag. Happy holidays. We're going to go put these by the stairs for now because I don't think any more deliveries are coming through. Mm -hmm. And then we'll set it up tomorrow morning because I do know I have packages coming tomorrow. So let's go set these up. Oh, y'all see I put lights on my stairs. I never showed y'all that I did. <laughs> all right, so we're just gonna leave this here for now. Now we have to go get ready because we're not driving into the city tonight. We are going to be taking the train because nobody got time to be dealing with this traffic. All right, y'all, I got you guys on my other lens. So the quality of me might look the quality might look a little different. Still the same camera, but different lens. Have y'all my zoom lens because we're about to go to a little holiday event at the wharf. I look better, I don't look busted no more. You feel me? <laughs> Let's, can we get into this lip combo? Y'all, I am in love. But yeah, I had to switch um, my lenses as well as my microphone. I got my just like basic microphone on here and my regular lens because if I'm gonna be carrying this around tonight, uh, I'm not carrying around nothing heavy. That, that camera is heavy. So right now we're about to, um, about to head to the train station, hop on the train. We should be there right when the fireworks are. We gotta go. Okay, let's go. We are out and about in the uh, resting station. Zara, look, look, Zara, it's a polar bear over there. Look, it's a polar bear right here. <laughs> Come on. This is Zara's favorite building here. Huh? We are headed to the train right now. Lovey. This is the jacket of his that I love so much. I know, I see. Huh? Money green. Hey, manifest some more money. Yeah, we're heading on the train. Everybody's nice and warm. And we're gonna go going on an adventure. 